My name is Dario Englot. I'm Assistant Professor of Neurosurgery, Biomedical Engineering and Radiology here at Vanderbilt University Medical Center. I'm also the uh, Surgical Director of uh, Epilepsy. My lab is the Brain Imaging and Electrophysiology Network Laboratory and we're using different techniques such as imaging techniques and electrophysiology techniques to understand brain networks in neurological disorders and also normal brain states. So one of our major projects is within the field of epilepsy. One study that we're doing in patients with a disease called temporal lobe epilepsy, which is the most common seizure disorder, involves imaging them before surgery and then taking recordings from the brain as they're being evaluated for surgery. And then down the road, after a few years after surgery, imaging them again to see what's changed in the brain. And one of the exciting things that we're seeing is that many patients after surgery can stop having seizures. They will often have long-term improvements in some of their neurocognitive function. And we're seeing changes in brain connectivity and brain networks that mirror some of those cognitive improvements. And for the first time is really helping us explain why are these patients getting better? One of the engineers that we're working very closely with is uh, Dr. Vicki Morgan, and she is a biomedical engineer in the radiology department. She has the expertise that combined with the clinical information that we have and, and combined with my background as a neurosurgeon and also as a neuroscientist uh, helps us come at the problem from multiple different angles. Working in a vice lab like ours provides a lot of unique opportunities to a student. And so for the graduate students that work with me, I find it important for them to come to the operating room, see the operations, meet some of the patients. And I've noticed that when I work with graduate students, I hope that they learn from me, but in addition, I'm always learning from them. And I think that kind of relationship, mentor-mentor-mentee relationship, helps us grow and helps us develop new ideas and come up with strategies that we otherwise wouldn't have come up with. I think the bottom line is the reason that we do the work that we do is ultimately to help patients. And really the best way to identify problems, find out a way to test the, our hypotheses and then solve these problems is individuals working together, both clinicians, engineers, and other scientists and VICE gives us a really unique opportunity to do that in our lab.